Please welcome President Ronald Reagan, who has a few questions for you. All of you will go to the polls, who stand there in the polling place and make a decision. I think when you make that decision, it might be well if you would ask yourself, are you better off than you were four years ago? President Trump, he'll make America great again. Hi guys, it's Bags and President Ross. The website we are using today is realclearpolling.com. Today we have an updated election map. Who do you guys want to win? Let us know in the comments. Also, like, share, and sub. Up first, we have Washington or Washington State, depending on where you're from in the USA, with 12 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. Oregon or Origin in some parts of the USA with eight electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. California with 54 electoral votes. If you're there from California, please shout us out in the comments. Blue for Kamala Harris. Alaska with three electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Montana with four electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Idaho, not Utah, with four electoral votes, is red for Donald J. Trump. Nevada, or Nevada, it depends, let us know in the comments, with six electoral votes, is currently, real clear polling says it's blue for Kamala Harris, but other reports say that it's red for Donald J. Trump, so we're going to keep Nevada a toss-up state, just to be fair. Arizona, with 11 electoral votes, is red currently for Donald J. Trump. It's been flip-flopping between red and blue. Utah with Mitt Romney and six electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Wyoming with three electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Colorado with 10 electoral votes is heavily blue for Kamala Harris. New Mexico with five electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. North Dakota with three electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. South Dakota with three electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Nebraska is red for Donald J. Trump. The second big district in Nebraska is red for Donald J. Trump. The littlest district in Nebraska is blue for Kamala Harris. Kansas with six electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Oklahoma with seven electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Texas with 40 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. If you are from Texas, give us a shout out. We love Big Tex. Woohoo! Minnesota, don't you know? Uh, with 10 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. Going back to red, Iowa with six electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Missouri with 10 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Arkansas with six electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Louisiana with eight electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Wisconsin is still a toss-up state. Speaking of which, if you are a Wisconsinite, give us a shout out in the comments. Tell us where you're from. We will not be coloring this in. Illinois, with 19 electoral votes, is blue for Kamala Harris. If you're from Illinois, let us know. Give us a shout out in the comments. We'd love to hear from you guys. Michigan, with 15 electoral votes, is still a toss-up. It's been flipping light pink to full dark blue, thanks to Gretchen Shipmer, the governor. It just depends on what it will be on November 5th at this point. If you're from Michigan, give us a shout out. We love the blue. Indiana with 11 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Ohio with 17 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Kentucky with eight electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Give us a shout out if you're from Kentucky. Tennessee with 11 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Mississippi with six electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Sweet home Alabama cousin lover state is red for Donald J. Trump. Give us a shout out if you're from Alabama and do you love your cousin? Florida, with 30 electoral votes, is red for Donald J. Trump. If you're from Florida, the Sunshine State, give us a shout out. We'd love to hear from you guys. Georgia, with 16 electoral votes, is currently leaning light red, but we're going to make it full red for Donald J. Trump. 
South Carolina with nine electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. And recent polls indicate that North Carolina is turning red once more for Donald J. Trump. Virginia with 13 electoral votes, if you're from Virginia, give us a shout out, is blue for Kamala Harris and the Democrats. West Virginia with four electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Pennsylvania, after recent rallies and interviews and rally times and rally halls, is currently red for Donald J. Trump. Wow. And the rest of the states in Maine, Maine on the top right, is red for Donald J. Trump. It's flip-flopping almost every two days between blue and red. But the rest of the states are blue for Kamala Harris. That includes New Hampshire, Vermont, Connecticut, New Jersey, Delaware, Massachusetts, Rhode Island, and uh, the District of Washington, D.C., all blue for Kamala Harris. And Philadelphia. Got to throw Philadelphia in. And we are going to do Hawaii also with four electoral votes. Last of all is blue for Kamala Harris. Shocker there. If you're from Hawaii, shout us out. We love the way Hawaii looks. Like, share, comment, subscribe, and baby, ask the question. Who do you guys want to win? We are Bags. And President Ross. And we are out. Woo! As a border state prosecutor, she took on drug cartels and jailed gang members for smuggling weapons and drugs across the border. I'm Kamala Harris, and I approve this message.